hi guys and welcome back to my channel my name is tamara of tamara fashion style and if this is your first time here please subscribe to my channel please hit the notification bell so that you won't miss any video from me and remember there you can learn a lot about pattern drafting so please share my channel so others can benefit so today in this video i'm going to show you how to draft a square patch pocket now the square patch pocket, you can put it on trouser, you can put it on skirt, skirt back or the skirt front, you can even put it on a short, right? So, the first thing we're going to need for draft this square patch pocket, we're going to need some paper, you're going to need a marker, you're going to need a scissors, a paper scissors, I'm using two marker here, so one to write and one to draw, right? Next, what we're going to need? You're going to need also a ruler and we're going to need a measuring tape. So here is the idea notion that we will need to draft this pocket. Now this is just a simple basic pocket. Now I'll show you how to draft this pocket and in my next video I will show you how to put this pocket on, on the skirt and how to sew it together. So first thing we're going to do, we're going to get our ruler. And we're going to just draft a guideline. Now, this is just a guideline we're drafting here. So, I'm drafting just maybe about a 5 centimeter guideline. Now, we'll do this um, patch pocket in centimeter. If you guys want to see how to do it in inches, please let me know. And I could do it back in inches for you. But today, we will focus on the centimeter we will do it in. Now, after you draw your guideline, you're going to get your ruler and you're going to draw out a 14 centimeter line from the guideline. Right? So this is the width of the pocket, 14 centimeter. Right? Next, you're going to get your ruler and from the 14 centimeter, you're going to draw down 16 centimeter on this line. So this top here, this is the top of the pocket. So this is 14 70 centimeter. Right, so this would be the top of the pocket. Now from this top line here, you're gonna grab your ruler, you're gonna line it up, and then we're gonna mark down 16 centimeter. Now this 16 centimeter is the length of the pocket. So now you're gonna close off the pocket with the same 14 centimeter like the top. So the pocket, the patch pocket is 14 by 16 centimeter right let me repeat so the pocket size would be 14 centimeter by 16 centimeter so as you guys can see i'm writing in all my details here and now this is the top of the pocket i'm writing here so i won't get mixed up then i write the side of the pocket the bottom of the pocket right so i won't get mixed up so this is the side of your pocket it's 14 centimeter by 16 centimeters. As I said, if you want to see me do this in inches, please request it and I will do it for you. Now, you want to grab your ruler and remember we have to get a seam allowance for the top of the pocket. So you'll put 2 centimeters in at the top of the pocket. This is for fold the pocket down so that you won't have any raw edge. So this is 2 centimeters in the top. Now, for the um, side of the pocket for the stitching, we're going to only put one centimeter on the side of the pocket. So the top would be two centimeter because that have a bigger hem. And the sides and the bottom, the two sides and the bottom, we're going to put one centimeter. So grab your ruler and let's put one centimeter at the side of the pocket, the bottom of the pocket as well. We're going to put one centimeter on the bottom of the pocket. So get your ruler and draw in your one centimeter. Make sure your ruler is straight. Next, you're going to go to the side of the pocket and you're going to put the other one centimeter to the side of the pocket. And this is what your patch pocket will look like. You guys see? Simple, easy, and quick. Now I'm going to redraw in this um, seam alone so it can touch the main pocket. And you see how simple and easy this square patch pocket look. And as I said, this pocket, you can put it on a skirt back 
a skirt front or you can put it on a trouser or a short now i'm going to draw in the green line of this pocket here so i'm going to use a different color marker to draw in the green line of this pocket as you can see me doing here so i could um know how to line up this pocket for cut this pocket now on this pocket now because we have a folding down with two centimeter we need to put a notch or a arrow showing that this pocket need to fold down at the top so that it could be neat and nice so you see as i do here i put an arrow now I put a notch at the two sides of the um the two centimeter when i fold it down it would come and neaten right the reason why i put two centimeters is because i want to fold it down so go ahead and draft in your pocket and fold it down you're gonna write in your details so since i put my green line and i put my notches you want to know how much pieces of pocket you want to put now you're gonna write this square patch pocket onto this pattern so this is the square patch pocket that i'm writing on all the details to the pattern right now here right and i do it with a different color marker because if this pattern had to go to like a pattern company like for develop into different sizes i will have to mark it in different color marker now you're going to write if you want to cut two pocket if you are doing on both sides of the trousers or both sides of the skirt or the, the whatever you want to put it you can put cut two or if you are only doing it on one side of the garment you will put cut one right so this is what your patch pocket look like and you see it's simple it's easy and quick so i always try to make my sewing and my drafting very easy i don't want to make it too difficult so now i'm gonna highlight this um 16 centimeter that i have here and i'm gonna highlight the 14 centimeter as well so if you want and you find your drafting is too dark you can use the colored marker and highlight how much um width and length the pocket is so just remember this pocket is 14 centimeter by 16 centimeter if you want to see me draft it in inches you can request it and i can do it back for you in inches for those who um learn only with inches i learn from both so i can draft it in any inches or centimeter now grab your scissors and let's cut out this pocket so we're going to cut out this pocket and remember to cut outside the seam allowance line you don't want to cut inside because or else your pocket um when you cut it out on the fabric it's going to be very sharp so what you need to do is cut outside the seam allowance line and like what i'm doing here so we're going to cut outside the seam allowance line so go ahead and cut out your pocket and then we will take it from there and as i said don't forget to subscribe to my channel hit that notification bell and i have a membership on my channel which the button would come out just now youtube will put the button out because they have to put the button onto my channel so when it come out you guys will know and you will see how to do many things on my membership channel so this is what your patch pocket look like you take a good look at it so it's a square patch pocket right and if you look at the subheading you'll see it's a square patch pocket so this is what the patch pocket look like now i'm gonna get um my notcher so that i can notch the end of this um two edge of the pocket where it have to turn down here so this is my notcher here it fell on the ground so i had to go and pick it up sorry for the delay so now you're gonna get your notcher if you have one now I purchased this little um tool that I have here. I think they call it a paper nacho. And I purchased this off of Amazon. And I it come two in a pack kit. So I'm gonna notch the two edges where the two centimeter seam allowance have to turn down to the inside of the pocket. I'm gonna also notch the one centimeter in the bottom of the pocket where it have to fold inside so that it can stitch out also put one in the middle of the top on the bottom so now after i finish notching my um pocket here 
I'm going to show you how to fold down the top of this pocket. Now, in my next video, I'm going to show you how to stitch this pocket. I'm going to show you how to stitch it, and I'm going to show you where to place it on to your garments, whether it's your trouser, your skirt, or your short. I'm going to show you how to place it on to the garments, the distance, and which part this pocket have to be placed in my next tutorial. So guys, this is how you turn this down. Now I'm turning this down just to show you how the inside of the pocket would look. And it would look very neat. That's why we put the two centimeters. So make sure you measure your pocket so your hand can go into the pocket if you want your hand to go in. And this is how I do it. I get my phone and I would measure the distance and I would know how it would go in. So this is how you draft a simple square patch pocket. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope I was able to make it simple, easy, and quick for you. And I will see you in my next video, which I will show you how to place this pocket onto your garments. Just remember, subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to hit the notification bell. And don't forget to share my channel. And look out for my next video in how to stitch it down on your garment. I will see you and you have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.